just um, gapping these these rockers, these valves, so the exhaust are uh, supposed to be uh, ten thousandths. So you got an adjusting screw and a lock nut. So. got to bring the opposite valve, um, it's got to be fully compressed, so if you're, like right now I'm doing the right exhaust valve, so you have to have the left one fully compressed, which means the push rod all the way up, and they're both, you're doing both the exact same way, just opposite, when you do this one, this one's all the way up. You do this one, this one's all the way up. So you just get on here, your stator rotor nut, and just uh, turn the bike over. You can wash it. After you gap them, though, you want to double check everything. So I'm doing the exhaust valves right now. So, so I'm watching this right, the right exhaust valve come all the way up, push rod. It's just about to go down, so now I'm going to check my, my, my uh, clearance again, make sure uh, I'm still, yeah, alright, I'm, I'm, I'm rubbing, I'm rubbing, that's good, let me fill the other one one more time. That's why you gotta do them twice. To make sure that they're okay. You know. So that's the one I was just doing, so I gotta loosen it up. So break the nut. And uh, back her out a little bit. But there's the feeler I got it in. It's just a little bit, but you don't want it to be Touch, but now this one seems loose. Yeah. 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 Getting all ass backwards here, folks, but uh. Exhaust. It's like five minutes. Ha, <laughs> 
tried this little baby one. I made my life a little bit simpler. Thought I got this little one. That's good, but right, those are good. So that's ten thousandths for the exhaust. For the exhaust, do the intake next. <laughs> 